Um, hold on. Did you just eat Edward? Forming the duties of his office. Did we see Caesar? Well, hey, buddy. Thanks for stopping by. I am Digby, and today we are back in no time, where we are actually quite hungry. Now, can I actually drive around this, is a question I wouldn't mind answering. Um, yeah, I just need to go around this. That looks like, actually, way over there, that looks like Edward. But there is another campfire there. I didn't notice this last time I played, but there's actually kind of a structure of bridges or something going on. So, all right, well, first things first, let's go get unhungry, because that's going to be a serious issue in the very near future. And I do not want to have to worry about it. Now, which one of you is the one with the snacks? That one says Aethor, that one's empty, that one's empty. Of course, it's the one I can't see. Whoops, no, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to pick it up. There we go. Okay, is... Oh, no, it's not you, is it? No, it's this one way back there. Okay, box from 86. That should be my food. Let's get Aethor back in. God, I've got a lot of crap in my trunk. Yes, back you go. I'm going to put the other box in there in a minute. Yes, please. I will take a snack. I'm going to put you back in the trunk. I'm going to eat you. And I actually might put that in the inventory. Just so I don't have to worry about it. That way I'm, I won't lose it in the trunk. I am starting to panic about the sparks a little bit. Um, no, I want to enter the car, thank you. I don't need a destination. Oh, I must have had one that was still on the trunk. <laughs> uh, come on, snack box. Get in the car the way you meant to. Please, 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 can you just go in the car? I'm going to put you way up in the back. That's not what I wanted to do. I don't keep pushing the wrong button. Now I want to do that button. Okay, perfect. Um, how much? Okay, that's a fusion cell. I'm going to work on the assumption that I'm not an idiot and I do have another one, but I probably should get it out actually now, shouldn't I? Now that doesn't have a fusion cell in it. That one doesn't have a fusion cell in it. Um, fusion cell, dead, uranium, cool. Uranium, not a help. Um, fusion cell. Do I have one in here somewhere? No, I do have lots and lots of uranium. Nope, that's another dead one. Uh, okay, you know what? Problem for another day. Is what that's gonna be. Let's go find out what the hell Edward wants. Maybe he can hook me up. Nope, I'm gonna just leave that off. I'm gonna be very delicate. In so much as I ever do delicate. Now, do we want to go see Edward first, or do we want to explore a little bit? Because there is... What the hell was that? Hold on, hold on, something caught my eye. What, what were you? Oh, I forgot there's debris, didn't... Yes, yes, there is debris. Um, okay, well, we get a display. I'm working on the assumption that's going to end up being an ingredient at some point. Circuit board's never a bad idea to have. Um, another magnetometer. I wish I'd known that was going to be waiting here for me. I suppose you guys have any fusion cells kicking around in your wreckage, do you? Are you a fusion cell? No, you're a rock. Now, let's peek up along this side. Might as well have a little bit of a scavenger hunt before we get too excited. Okay, I think we've got everything. But yeah, I'm half tempted... Oh... Those might actually be the tribesmen, so maybe Edward's actually hiding in the cave. Well, let me go see if I got a box with some space. Okay, you only got a magnetometer, so you're perfect. Yes? Perfect. So, if I open that box now, I should be able to put the other magnetometer, the display, and the circuit board in it. Yes, I can. Why are you telling me there's another snack kicking around here? All right, well, that's... Yep. Wouldn't be Digby if I didn't punch the hatch. Oh, God. All right, yeah. Just in case those are actually, like, the 
enemy tribesman that kidnapped Edward. Let's go over here to the cave and see if he's hiding in there. Because, yeah, I see a couple of campfires, but I can't tell what is over beside him. I mean, the cave is here, yes? Ow. I mean, it should be here. Is there no cave here? Well, you know what? Oh, never mind. It's got, like, the entrance blocked. Somehow, some way. Can I open that? Can I sneak up there? Absolutely not. Okay, the cave is there, but it's blocked off. So, Edward is definitely not there. Let's go have a peek at the other campfires. Okay, those look like tribes people. So, we're just gonna... Well, probably blow their mind a little bit. I'm going to actually, in case they turn out to be bad guys... No, six. Six is the one I want. Yep, they are bad guys. Um, E pick up. Oh shit, I didn't see that one. Wild native. Okay. So yes, we are going to be fighting our way through, everybody. Well, that's good to know. Let me go get a little... There we go. Yeah, let me go get a little closer to the uh, bridge here. In case we end up having to make a getaway. I don't know if we'll be coming down... Is that a street? That's a sign or something. What the hell? No, I want to exit now. Thank you. Whoa, they're throwing stuff at me. Hey. That's not fair. You are no match for the boopy gun. Okay, there's something down there, isn't there? Aha! I think we found him. It looks like something up top of... Oh, no, it's just his exclamation point. Hey, Edward, buddy. How you been? Ha ha. Pauses. Whispers. You made it. Guess that input date problem is only a small problem for you. Your younger self helped me out. I see, very smart. You can see I'm in quite a fix. You need to get me out of here. The time conduction circuit got fried. Well, that's not good at all. No, it isn't. Pauses in thought. I've been trying to get some of the technology from the agents. Well, that is why I got caught in the first place. The agents' portable machines do not function on the same hardware, though. So retrieving them might not solve this issue, and we can't use them for time travel as their programming is completely ruined due to the virus. We need a new circuit. Mr. Crimson's jet, maybe? You might search for the conduction circuit inside the wreck. It should be likely at the bridge. You need to get it. There is no other way. There is another thing I might need you in. Really? These bars are pretty strong. You will have to break them open via some kind of tool. I left my gun at the friendly tribe where the old forest is. I left it there because it's hindered me at being sneaky. So should I go to them? Yes, wait, here, take this Ulu Malu. It is a token of friendship to them. Yes, it is a friendly greeting of sorts. I wear it because they gave it to me. I hope this will help you. Now wait, wait. I don't think they will understand a word you say. I have devised plans for a translation unit, so I will give you the plans and you go make the thing. Without the Ulu Malu, they won't talk. Without the device, you can't understand them, so you need both. Okay. Here are the plans. I saw a native guy mess around with my Mr. Crafty up at one of the campfires here around. I'm sure you might be able to salvage any parts to craft the translator out of the time jet. Watch out, though. The reactor might have gotten unstable due to the crash. After you manage that, try to get my laser back, and then go back to me. Oh, and then come back to me. Okay. Weren't the agents dialed to the future? They were, but the date was not computable. As expected. It was worth a shot. The future would have been the safest date, thinking that they would likely change the distant past drast drastically. How do we use the translation device? Just have it in your inventory or hold it while you are talking to them. If my calculations are correct, the lingual stream would correct the grammatical strings into the right consonants and vowels. What the hell happened to Crimson? Yes. Oh, down there in the other cage. I think you won't get a healthy conversation out of him. Just leave him to his own spoils. Gotcha, buddy. Okay, we got an Ulamalu. Now, can I put this in my inventory? And the gun, because I want my boopy gun, damn it. Why am I not picking up my boopy gun? There we go, please pick it up. 
Okay, okay, so now I have no hands. So what I need to do is go to four. Eat the rest of this snack. Whoops. Now I can go to one. Okay, I've got everything I need apart from the translation device thing. Okay, he's in there, so we'll just we'll leave him to it. He looks like he's quite happy there. Oh, for God's sakes, really with the thing. Nope. Nope, where are you? Four. You're in four now. Whoops. Okay, can we stop hitting me with rocks, please? Okay, did I actually... Maybe they were at... No, because I, I would have seen this campfire. How did I not see there, Mr. Crafty? Um, okay, well, you know what, bud? I've got one of my own, but... Uh, stop doing that. That's what you want to do. Yes, I'll bring this one anyway, just in case. Where the hell did I park the car? Um, oh, I parked the car way the hell over here. Okay, yeah, I ran right by the Mr. Crafty and didn't even see it. And to be fair, it was a bit darker back then. Alright, you are Mr. Crafty. Oh, can I actually look at you and see what I need for... Alright, lingual translation device. I need a magnetometer, a circuit board, and a display. Well, isn't that convenient? I just so happen to have found all three of those things not that long ago. It was this one. It is. Okay. So I just click you out, click you out, click you out. I should be... What the hell was that? Oh, that was the circuit board. Now we should be able to craft that. Cool. Okay, you... Come on, pick up the box. I want my box back. I need my box. Oh, actually, you know what? What do I have in my inventory I don't actually genuinely need right now? Oh, God. How long have I been lugging around a health kit? Stop bouncing. Okay, six. Eat a drop. What is five? That's a key card. I can drop that. All right, four I need. Why do I have two booby guns? No. Nope. What in the hell? Okay, look. Two. Nope, that's three. Okay, three is a boopy gun. Two is also a boopy gun. So if I drop one boopy gun... I still have another one, yes? Okay, not sure what happened there, but you know what? Not gonna argue. So please can I put the... Uh, key card in it, the med kit in it, and the boopy gun in it. There we go. Okay, thank you very much for your service. Because I definitely want that in my inventory. So I'm going to pick you up and store you in the inventory. Now I have to go get the other thing out of the friggin' big ship. How the hell do I get into the big ship? I mean, I can see the window. This is going to be a treat. I can see this coming. Uh. Right, I'm trying to remember which one Crouch is. Oh, okay, never mind. The window's broken. I'm thinking just in case they missed anybody. Now I don't have a booby gun anymore. What in the hell? Nope. God's sakes. Okay, look. Push the crouch button. There you go, Digby. Okay, not sure what the hell happened to my booby gun. Oh, it's another display. Um. Well, we know where we put it. Oh, everything looks incredibly unhappy. I'm gonna open you. You have my booby gun. Leave. Where's my booby gun? Is it in my inventory now? No, it is not. It's in the back of this somewhere. Can I please have my boopy gun? Can I please have my boopy gun? Alright, we're gonna just unpack the car for an hour. That's fine. Um, boopy gun? You're not still in the box, are you? No, you're definitely not in the box. 
But you know what? You can have a vintage radio now. All right, organization. How cool is that? I'm not seeing my boopy gun. Is it on the... It's on the roof of the damn car. Okay, never mind. I'm an idiot. All right, you get in there. I have absolutely screwed this up. I had this all nice and organized. Oh, well, I got it apart. Is there another fusion cell? Nope, that one's zero. Uranium. Aha! I do have a fusion cell that's got 200 on it. Perfect. All right, I'm not totally hopeless. I can actually do things on occasion. Can I shut that? There, everything's now neatly packed. So, let's get this one out of there. Drop you in the way back. Make sure that's gonna shut. Nothing freaks out, perfect. Okay, now. Oh, sorry, I had to cough. My sinuses are still an absolute nightmare. Oh, I didn't grab the booby gun. Whoops. <laughs> I'm going to grab that. Yes, now we're talking. Okay, I'm ready, I think. If anything horrible happens in here. Alright, I'm not taking that magnetometer. I'm just, I'm not. Not unless I absolutely have to. I have a spare somewhere. Alright, that isn't anything apparently. It's just there. Alright, what is a time conduction? Aha! Can I? Okay, I've got it. Excellent. Oh, shit. Okay. Whoops. No. Um, I think I'm about to have a very bad time. Can I get out this way? No, I cannot. Can I get out at all? Please, can I get out? Aha, I just got stuck a little bit. Okay, run. Run, run, run. Oh, shit. Okay. Here's a thought, Digby. Remap the crouch key someday. I'm just gonna run like hell. Hope it doesn't hurt my car. Wild native. Okay, yeah, look, I'll deal with you in a second, okay? I gotta check my car. No, I want that. Alright, doesn't look that bad. What's the damage? 96. Okay, we came out of that fairly well off. Now, he told me after this I had to go to get the other thingy from the nice natives. Hang on, though, because I see a guy that's still standing up, and I don't like that. You, my little friend, can I actually... Ooh, I did. Can you hit me with a rock from there? Seriously. You tried that like that was a thing. getting really tired of the rocks, guys. Well, hopefully my map tells me... Oh, poor Crimson. Hopefully my map will tell me where this uh, place I need to be is. Oh, let's look. Map. Old Forest. Okay, so it's actually directly behind us. That's going to be about it on this map, isn't it? Oh no, Sandy Cave is still there. Coral Reef and Jack's Beach. Well, you know what? We'll just turn around. We'll head for the old forest. I think in for this one, we're going to fly. Might as well completely screw the natives up. Yep, that one was a sneeze. Okay, so the new forest is over this way, yes? Hopefully. Hopefully I don't crash into it, because I can't fix my damn car anymore. Alright guys, where are you? Okay, we're getting a bit low for my comfort zone here. Um, okay, you know what? Check the map. It's fine. Down this way. You down there? I can't tell. Am I sinking? I'm sinking. Okay. They're either down here or they're on top of that hill. I figure. Maybe. It's got to be one or the other, right? We'll try down here first, because that'll be wrong, and they'll be up on top of the hill. Now, I ain't even gonna attempt to fly through all these damn trees. Okay, giant dinosaur thing. Don't... Okay, lots of giant dinosaur things. Maybe somewhere else would be a nice place to be. 
How's the map looking? I overshot them. Guess what? They're on top of the damned hill. Okay. Velociraptor dudes, can you not mess with me? You look more like a Velosa chicken, but... Okay, you know what? They're on the ground. I don't have to be. Let's go straight up. And around. And... Whoop. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. No, that's the way. Uh-huh, uh-huh, we like it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. All right, why am I not seeing you guys? I mean, I'm in the right general spot, yes? I don't see anything that even remotely resembles tribes people. Why am I so far out of whack? Nope, that's even worse. God's sakes. Hold on. I'm going to try and land the damn car and not get killed. I'll be right back. Oh, this is going to hurt. Yep, that hurt. Ow. Okay, sorry guys. Oh, Jesus, this is not a nice place to drive. Where are your friends? The hell? I don't think I want to know what's going on with that. Alright, dudes. Um, did I just get attacked by a dinosaur? No, but I'm hearing... I can hear what sounds a bit like voices, but it might be them buzzing depending on what they are. Okay, this is promising. We have found what appears to be a man-made structure. Or a couple of them, actually. So hopefully this is where I'm meant to be. Well, before I go say hi, how about we get out of here? Oh, Jesus. Oh, how about we... Okay, stop. Stop, 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 stop. I'm trying to reload. The thing won't let me. How you like them apples? Okay. Raw meat. No, thanks. I'll, I'll pass. Can I hide in here and change? Okay, this should be safe for a minute. Now, let me look at my inventory. I need to have this in my inventory. And I need to hold this. Yes? I should say before I do this. Hi, guys. Me and friend. Are you a friend? Please be my friend. Oh, hold on. Before we get excitable about stuff, I just noticed what my health was at. Uh, I don't have the option to wear that. Okay, well. Hope you guys really don't mind this car. Thank God I bought snacks. Ah, that should help the health a little bit. Actually, let's shut the trunk. Now we'll hold the Ulamalui. Okay, health is coming back. Who do I need to talk to? Who's the... Who's the... Who's the big guy in the tribe here? Are you the big guy? Oh, wait a minute. There's a way up here on the hill. New location. Old city. Yes. Digby is an idiot. I'm gonna guess the guy I need is up here. Aha! Hi, dude. Time Manu, hi. Greetings, Time Human. Friend of Edward. Hmm. Ba. Hakma. Misa. Don't go Misa. That's the Jar Jar thing. Okay, took me a minute. I was trying to read all this in my head. Hmm. Ba. Yeah. You know what? Never mind. Great. We've been waiting for you. Access Edward's house. Of course, you can enter as a friend of Edward. You are always welcome. Thank you. Uh-oh. Okay, what? How rude. How dare you say that about our ancestors. What? Okay, they don't like the word thank you. Okay. How nice of you to say that. I am flattered. I guess let me open the door for you. Please do. This is Edward's hut. Yes? Okay, there's Edward's thingy. So I can pick that up. 
I can't use it. Can I toggle it? Oh, okay. No, that's that's bad thing to do. Don't do that. Tell me I got room for it. I do. That's the last thing I have room for. That was also, I think, the last thing I needed here, yes? I got the conduction circuit. I got his laser. Yeah, we should be good to go. I hope. Yeah, you know what I'm going to do? I am going to save it. No, I'm not, because I don't know if I'm recording. Hold on, I need to check to see if I'm recording. Yep, I am. Okay. Perfect. I should save, but you know what? I'll, I'll wing it. I'm happy to risk it. But I'm not going to risk it without the boopy gun. Nope. That's... What am I just pushing the wrong damn buttons? There we go. Okay, I got my boopy gun. We should be good to go. Edward, my friend, I have got you sorted. Quick, come closer, yes. So, you need to switch the laser from safe to lethal so it can cut through these bars. We need to hurry. Okay, I already know how to do that. Just press tree through, oh. Oh no, behind you, oh crap. Holy crap, there's a bunch of them. Did I just shoot a rock out of the air? Oh god, there's a ton of them coming. Oh shoot. Oh, okay, was not expecting this. Can you please stop throwing rocks at me? Please be the last guy. Oh, shit. I can't... Hold on, Edward, buddy. I got other problems at the moment. I'm not exactly sporting a huge amount of health. Okay, you know what? I think that's the lot. Which one is yours? Two? Okay, nope. Two. I said two. Um, here. Okay, yep, I saw that coming. What the hell? Hold on. What the hell happened while I was gone? No, I didn't hear that. Well, I did hear that. I just wish I hadn't heard that. Oh, boogers. Edward, buddy, protect me. It's a giant platypus. Of course it's a giant platypus. Okay, I just have to dodge it. It has to miss me, right? I'm totally dead because I don't have any snacks on me. Because I didn't know I was going to be battling a giant idiotic platypus. Edward Bud, he's he's dead now. You can just thump him. Okay, he missed me that time. Perfect. I killed him. Now what? Um, hold on. Did you just eat Edward? You can't eat Edward, you bastard. What in the hell is going on? I need to give it a laser. Why well, don't know how to survive being swallowed by a giant platypus and a kiss? What? Okay, never mind. Edward's fine. Oh, I think I figured out how we survived it. I don't know what just happened. In that case, let us go on. Follow me, quick, there is no time. Lead on. I will cut through the gates with the laser. Please do. Can we just go? I just, I don't want to be here anymore. Okay, follow me. Oh crap, there's a whole ton of them up there. Oh, hi Crimson. Low rage, you think you can just go on and forget about me? Oh, all you dudes are in there. Yeah, well, we can't let you free. This is not the last time you have... Oh, this is not the last time you will be hearing from me. 
All right, let's go. Yes, please. I'm delighted to go. I even remember where the hell I parked. Mr. Crimson Edward. He's not happy about that. I'm just going to leave your Mr. Crafty, my friend. I'm sorry. You can build another one. All right, Edward, my friend, please. Please come get in the damn car. Oh, you little wretched... Okay, stop. 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 I just wanted to get some snacks or get somewhere safe. Oh, crap. I'm actually dead. I will be in a minute. Yep, I'm dead. Okay, well, maybe this time around we'll see what the hell happened. Okay, Future Digby here. If you're wondering why we're back at the beginning, it's because um, I actually have rerun this quest twice now. This is going to be the third time I have to go through it to get to where we left off. Uh, yeah, first time the uh, platypus died in the middle of the arena, so there was a big like a glitch. Edward got stuck, and then when I pushed him out of the way, he was still kind of stuck. He just kept saying goodbye to me, and that was it. He wouldn't open the door with the laser. And the second time, I actually got killed by the damn platypus. So, yeah, I'm going to leave this episode here, and we'll pick it up in the next one. We'll go, hopefully, I'll redo the quest off camera, and then we will start with fighting the damn platypus, and hopefully we don't screw everything up and it'll work. But, yeah, um, as always, I have been Digby. I thank you all for stopping by. I really hope you enjoyed this episode of No Time, and I hope to see you for the next one.